The community vaccination clinic at Military Circle Mall is now operating under new hours, giving people more time to get a life-saving shot or booster as COVID-19 cases continue to surge. But as 10 in your size, John Dowding discovered more people are looking for tests than shots. John? Yeah, well, Stephanie, Mon Stephanie, Mondays are testing days at the site, but as we reported yesterday, new community testing centers are coming across the state. So those we spoke to today say those sites couldn't come fast enough, especially as they struggle to find a test right now. It's frustrating. On a day dedicated to vaccinations, the main thing people asked for was a test at Military Circle. Donna Sharp came back from visiting family in New York and was looking for a test just to be safe. She says she's frustrated with the minimal options available for a test. With the holidays, people are coming from all over places, getting together with family, and you want to be safe, and we need adequate testing sites, not just on one day a week. We need it Monday through Saturday, tell you the truth. Another woman who asked we not show her face said she needs a negative test to go back to work by Monday. After finding out there are no tests today, she's stressed trying to figure out where to go. Tried to go on the P Department of Health website and went through all those uh, contacts. Um, most of them say you have to go online to find a test and they're booked way out or there's none available at all. Many others came looking for a test as well. One woman from the Norfolk SBCA, however, did come to get her booster. She says she always planned to get one since she works around people all the time, but feels especially unsettled seeing cases continue to climb. It's disruptive, but in a way that you're not sure sometimes what to do. And I think people are concerned about each other and their families and, you know, whether they should get together, things that you should do, things that you should not do. As for Donna, She's optimistic and hopeful she can get her hands on one. Well, I'm not going to get overwhelmed. Just look, and if it's nothing today, prayerfully I'll find something tomorrow. Now, there's no set date right now as to when those new clinics will open across Hampton Roads. Governor Ralph Northam did speak about those effects of the surge on hospitals today and encouraged people to get vaccinated and boosted to stop the spread. John Dowding, 10 on your side.